ready for this fight, and Saturday I will show my best to everybody here. What do you think about the video of the fight you're going to be fighting? What do you think? It's going to be a strong, easy game? Is he much for you? Is he fight? Or do you think it's going to be a hard, uh, a hard fight where you're going to have to be very tactical? Hard fight. Okay. Okay. I, I fight for Morocco, and uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm ready for this fight tomorrow against uh, Mako Jurek. Good fighter. It's going to be a, a hard fight, and I will uh, do my best to uh, to uh, uh, take the win and uh, make a spectacular fight for the for the for the public. Yes, uh, it's my first time I fight uh, in, uh, in Abu Dhabi. Um, and uh, what I've seen in this country is that it's a very good, uh, uh, a nice country, uh, and I think uh, there will be a lot of opportunities uh, for us in this country to uh, to uh, to grow in, uh, in kickboxing and in this uh, sport. Does it give you extra motivation to fight here in Abu Dhabi? Uh, yes, of course, because I show myself uh, I show myself good in in in, in the Netherlands, and I would like to uh, to uh, show uh, show who I am uh, here in Abu Dhabi, and maybe just be a little part of the face of the sport and uh, show that we uh, that we do our best uh, to uh, to to make uh, yeah to make the, the publicity of the sport uh, good. Was it difficult to prepare yourself during Ramadan? Uh, no, it, 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 it was not uh, difficult to prepare uh, in Ramadan because uh, it, it gave me power. I think it's something. Uh, I think I think it's something above natural, uh, and uh, that that the strength that I got it's uh, it's from Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. And uh, yeah, I feel I've, I've, I feel uh, very f uh, fit uh, during Ramadan, and the training were were uh, were uh, were, uh, were while we are f uh, fasting. So yeah, it it, 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 w it wasn't heavy for me or something. I just feel good and fit and strong. To finish, a few words for your bones. A few words from my opponent. Yeah, I uh, I respect him. Uh, I know he's a good fighter, and uh, I uh, we will see tomorrow. I uh, don't like talking uh, talking uh, uh, before the match. I talk uh, while the match is uh, busy. Salam alaikum to everybody in Abu Dhabi, and I want to thank the promoter to uh, uh, for having me to show my skills tomorrow. My name is Juan Javier Barragan. I come from Holland, but I fight for Spain, and I'm glad that I can show my skills tomorrow at Arab Boxing for the world title against Charlie Peters from England. Is a special way for the lot of heat down here? I didn't train specially for a lot of heat, because the heat is for me is a problem, but also for my opponent is a problem. Because outside the uh, Yeah, I've, I've um, been a lot of times outside instead of being in the hotel, because then you get comfortable with the, with the heat outside. That's the only thing I did. You just started a new collaboration with the last the world champion, Fikir Tijassi. I heard you were training with him, started to train with him. Did you, does this give you extra motivation or extra, extra um, how can I say, skills for this upcoming fight? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always good to train with champion, with other champions. But um, not for this fight, I didn't train especially with, with Fikri, but I had a conversation with Fikri about our future, so that's true. I represent the UK, fighting out of Double K in London. I want to say thank you very much to the guys that brought me over to fight here in Abu Dhabi. I feel very privileged and very honoured and very excited to bring a good show for you tomorrow. I'm fighting Juan from Spain, very nice guy. Uh, don't know too much about him, but I have a lot of respect for him, and he has, he's very good, he's very strong, and has a good heart, so I'm sure it's going to be a very good fight. But I'm here to upset people, so tomorrow will be a very good fight. It doesn't, doesn't bother me so much. I've trained in Holland, I've trained in Thailand, I fight Thai boxing and K1. I understand the difference. Obviously, each fight is very different, scoring, and the pace of the fight is very different. I think all the K1 fights I have had have been you got a rotation, a rotation in uh, Abu Dhabi, okay, for a match uh, on the uh, Germany. It's very, very uh, fighters, uh, it's strong. Oh, um, I come here for a very match, I'm very strong. Your name is Paolo Barbanti, Barbanti okay, Italy. Uh, I have uh, 10 match for uh, Keep boxing, uh, Muay Thai. 
Altro? Non saprei. Ok. Question? Bravo. Conosco qualcosa di tuo volo pont? Allora, per... Ok, yes. I, I see the, the video. Ok, it's very strong man, very strong fighters. It's very, very, very champion. Giusto? Yes. The first, uh, first match in, uh, in, uh, in, uh, in boxing. Yes, for boxing in uh, Abu Dhabi. It's very, very good. Ok. Uh, congratulations and invitation for the organizer uh, only um, Abu Dhabi. For, for, yes, in Italy, for a match for K1, a uh, max free, free round for free means. My name is Dan Zola and I'm from Germany. Thank you. 
معنا من المملكه العربيه آه عرفكم بالاسف عاطف اسماعيل مدير شركه مودز للسياحه بجمهوريه مصر العربيه وشركه رؤيه للسياحه بالمملكه العربيه السعوديه طبعا احنا نعمل في قطاع السياحه وقناه السفر والسياحه والطيران لكن لما زعلنا ان هذه البطوله بطوله العالم للملاكمه العربيه ستنظم وتقام في دوله الامارات العربيه المتحده في خيمه التواصل العالميه تحت رعايه الدكتور عبد الله النهادي طبعا انا وشريكي الاستاذ عبد الله شهيد شركه رؤيه بالسعوديه لن يعني لن نتهاون عن اتخاذ القرار برعايه هذه البطوله على اساس دعم الربط العربي بالدم بين الدول العربيه وعوده مصر على خريطه العربيه مره اخرى البطوله العالميه التي تقام في دوله الامارات العربيه المتحده وهي بطوله العالم الدوليه للملاكمه العربيه وكنا من الشركات التي حرصت على دعم وربط العلاقات العربيه بين الدول التي اقامت هذه البطوله في خيمه التواصل العالمي حيث ان خيمه التواصل العالمي تجمع جميع الدول العربيه التي تتواصل بينهما بينهما بعض وقلنا ان هذه المناسبه هي فرصه لدعم السياحه وعوده السياحه مره اخرى ورفع خريطه مصر على وضع خريطه مصر مره اخرى على العالم السياحي وان شاء الله باذن الله احنا قدمنا مبادره في هذه البطوله ان احنا ننتظر اقامه هذا الحفل الكبير وهذه البطوله مره اخرى بعد العيد وقريبا ان شاء الله داخل جمهوريه مصر العربيه وبالاخص في مدينه سياحيه مثل مدينه شرم الشيخ او مدينه الغردقه وذلك ليكون زي ترويج سياحي للعالم مره اخرى الى